Good morning, everyone. We are doing a 30 minute arms and core workout from home. I've got a set of dumbbells, I've got my water close by, and I'm excited to work out with you guys. So um, let's do a workout, all right, we ready? So let's jump on into our warm up first. We're gonna get the blood flowing, get your heart rate up. All of this you can do at home, which is so great, so efficient. 30 minutes, arms and core with Amy Jo. You guys ready? All right, so 10 push-ups is our first exercise of our warm up, okay? Not down. Nice and low, let's go, wake it up this morning, hit it for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna go right into high knees, get the heart rate up, ready for 10, go. One, two, three, four, five, pump those knees up, eight, nine, and 10. Burpees, still in the warm up here, okay, 10 of them. Let's go. Down, no push up, and jump it for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, awesome. Two, one more, and one. One more set of that for our warm up. Two rounds, we gotta make sure the blood's flowing. Down, 10 push ups. Ready? Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, keep the core tight. 3, 2, and 1. Take it into high knees. Right, left leg is one, we're going 10. Hit it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Woo, burpees. Last one for our warm up. Let's go. One, two, three, Four. Keep it up, come on, all the way to 10. Get that blood flowing, we gotta wake up. And go. One more. Woo! All right, you guys warm? I am. Okay, let's jump right into bicep tricep first, then we'll finish with core, okay? Grab your dumbbells. We are gonna do a curl first. Okay, so your one leg is forward. You're gonna do a split stance, and I want you to do single arm hammer curls. It's important to relax your shoulders here. We're gonna do 10 on each side. Slow and controlled. Okay, contracting your bicep at the top. And I say this a lot, but you have to think form first, intensity second. Relax the shoulders, alternating sides, elbows are in, okay, like a hinge on a door, hinge on the door, swing up and swing open, five more, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Okay, so the goal today is to superset between a bicep and a tricep, okay? So we just did our first bicep exercise. We're gonna roll right into a tricep and then we'll superset back and forth. These are overhead extensions with a press. Dumbbells come up over the head. You're extending back. When you come up, you're doing a narrow press right in front, hitting the triceps. Let's go for 10, hit it. Over and in front, two, Okay, I'm keeping my elbows pointing to the ceiling. Three, four, right here, you got it. Extend, five, breathe through it. Six, right in front, seven, you got it, come on, push. There's eight, elbows are in, nine, one more. Elbows in, press up, 10. 
Awesome. Okay, our super set is back to the alternating bicep curls. Relax the shoulders. Alternating, here we go for 20. Hammer curls. Okay, I like a split stance. Um, some of you might like to be just straight across, hip a little wider than hip width apart. Honestly, whatever's more comfortable for you, those who have a little more um, sensitive backs can even be in a split stance for support. Whew. Elbows are in, alternating. It's your time to get your arms stronger, right? Build the biceps, so make sure you're going all the way down. Take your time. It's not about speed, it's about form. Awesome, eight more. Seven, relax the shoulders, six, five, chest is up, four, three, two, and one. Okay, we're gonna take it to that overhead. Ready, back to it. We're doing three rounds of everything today, okay? Up and over, let's go. Extend, overhead extension, narrow press up in front. Woo, let's go. I'll show you from the front here. This is three. Here's four, five, six, come on, you got it, up over the head, seven, take your time, eight, you don't want to swing the weights, you want your triceps to do all the work, nine, one more, over, extend, in front, press, Woo! there's ten, all right, grab water when you need it. Okay, we're gonna do our last round right here. Back to the alternating hammer curls. Okay, make sure you relax your shoulders. Push back and down, okay? Core tight. Woo, let's go. 20, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, halfway. Let's go 10 more, 10. Nine, keep those elbows in. Eight, seven, good work. Six, come on, push. Four, three, two, one, and awesome. Right into triceps, okay, overhead. Ready, and get it. Up, extend, and then press in front. One, two, come on, you got it. Three, uh, showing you from the front. Four, uh, five, halfway, come on. Six, you should be really feeling this now. Seven, I know I do. Uh, eight, uh, get it. Nine, come on, train hard, train hard. And here's 10, extend, finish with a press. Uh, woo, great, good job. Okay, we're gonna go into skull crushers. Okay, that's gonna be laying on a bench or laying on your mat. Grab some quick water. So, I'm gonna take it to the floor here, but if you have a bench at home, you can absolutely lay on the bench as well. We're gonna do skull crushers for 10. So, laying on your back, over the head, extend back, and squeeze your triceps at the top. Okay, big stretch, go for 10, hit it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, big stretch, flex them hard at the top, one more, and 10, good work. Okay, this next one, I'm just gonna use one dumbbell and I'm gonna bring it to a staggered position. One leg is up. The hand um, that I have my dumbbell in, I'm resting on that inner thigh, okay? And I'm gonna curl up. Isolated curls, resting my elbow on the inner part of my thigh, okay? 10 on each side. Six, five, four. This helps keep you disciplined three, to not swing the arm, and it makes you go all the way down. And here's 10, good. Switch, other side. Okay, rest that elbow inside of the knee, and hit it. 10, 
nine, eight. Keep the chest lifted so you can breathe. Six, five, four. Isolate all the way down. Big stretch down. Three and two. One more and one. Come on now, back to school crushers. Grab both dumbbells, we're going for 10. On your back, let's do it. Big stretch and flex at the top. 10, nine, eight, seven, good work. Six, five, four, isolate really well. This is how you get your arms stronger, get them more built. Two and one. Good work. Back to the single arm. Okay, one leg is up. Rest that arm on the inside of the thigh and isolated curls. One, two, three, four. You guys doing all right? Five, six, kill it, come on. Big stretch, eight, here's nine. One more, curl for 10. Other side. Switch arms, isolated, make sure you're going all the way down, chest up and squeeze. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, big stretch, four, three, two, and here's 10. Awesome. Okay, we got a third round, everything, three sets today. On your back, skull crushers, Grab both dumbbells, let's go. Extend and hit 10. And squeeze, eight, seven, six, five. Let's go, big stretch, four. Come on, you got it, three. Here's two, one more, and one. Good work. All right, hang in there with me. Okay, one arm, isolated curls, and go. 10, nine, last set of these. Eight, seven, six, five, four, get it, big stretch down. Two, one more, and one. Other side, and go, switch. 10, nine, eight, keep it up. Seven, think about that form. <sighs> Breathe through it. Four and three, big stretch down. Two, one more and one. Awesome job, good work. Grab some water, we're gonna move into our third set. We've got another bicep and tricep and then we're gonna go into core. Okay. So these ones, we're gonna burn the biceps out. Okay, I'm gonna take you to standing here. And we're gonna do 21s. Okay, if you haven't done bicep 21s before, it's seven, seven, and seven. You're gonna do halfway up, up and down for seven. Once you finish seven, you're gonna come all the way up and you're gonna go only halfway down, starting in the up position for seven. Last set of seven, that takes us to 21, all the way down, all the way up for seven. Ready? First set, go. Halfway up. Okay, hip width apart, feet are hip width apart. Woo, three and two, halfway up, there's seven. Now you're gonna come all the way up, halfway down for seven, go. Seven, six, keep the core tight. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, all the way down, all the way up. We ready? Let's do it. And seven, these are to burn the biceps out. Six, five, don't swing your weight. Four, slow down if you need to. Come on, six, whoo, and seven. Awesome. Okay, we're gonna take it to one arm. Okay, these are tricep kickbacks. So I'm gonna show you a little bit closer here on these because I want you to do a kickback and a hold for a second and then you're gonna come slowly back to the return, okay? This is to make sure you have tension on the tricep the whole time, make the triceps work, burn them out. Ready, we're going for 10, and go. Kick back and hold, and reverse back. Kick back and hold, and reverse back. That's two, come on. Three, 
and four. That's why we're just doing one arm at a time so you can really focus on the squeeze. Five more, let's go. Back and squeeze, slow, slow, slow. Woo, seven, let's go. There's eight, here's nine, and then one more, one more. Kick back, hold it, and down. Awesome, other side. Okay, 10, and go. Kick, one, hold, fight on the negative. Three, hold back, four, hold back, five. See, I'm bending only at my elbow. Six, come on, you got it. Seven, Woo. eight, hold it back, fight the negative back. Nine, one more, hold, and 10. Awesome, right back into this 21s, okay? So like I said, if you need to slow down a little bit, take a short break, and then jump back in, totally fine. 21s, reminder, okay, halfway up, then we go halfway down, and then we go all the way up, all the way down for seven. Ready, go. Seven, six, five, you got it, come on. Four, three, two, and one. All the way up, halfway down. Seven, six, five, four. Control the weight, three, two, one. Full range, hit it, seven, Six, you got it. Five, four, three, ha, two, one more, and one. Good work. Okay, taking it to the tricep kickback. Okay, I'll come in a little closer here so you guys can see the form. Ready, back is flat, and go. One, two, Three, here we go. Kick back, squeeze, hold. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. Watch that form. Kick back, hold. Ah, ten. Woo, that last one's good. Okay, bend over. Back is flat and hit it. Ten, nine, eight. Seven, return slowly. Six, five, be disciplined, come on. Four, three, get the most out of this. Two, one more, and one. Good fight. Okay, we got one more round. Let's start back with the 21s. We're gonna burn it out. Ready, halfway up. Three, two, one, let's go. Halfway up, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, now start in the up position. Go, seven, six, five, four, come on, three, hang on to it, two, and one. All right, this is the tough part. All the way down, all the way up, finish it, go. Seven, six, five, four, you're doing great. Three, two more. And here's 21. Ugh. Whoo. Biceps. Gotta love it. Okay, bent over, kickbacks. Last one. Let's burn these triceps out. Then we're going into core. Okay, we ready? Elbow up and kick it. Whew. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Come on, you be in control of the weight. 5, 4, Three, two, one more, hold it, and down. That's 10, other side. Go, 10, nine, eight, seven, six. We got it, squeeze and hold, five. There's four, hold it, three. Slow on that negative, one more, and there's time. Awesome, buys and tries. Great job, you guys. We're gonna move into core now. So grab a quick drink. All right, stay with me. We're gonna take it down to the mat. Keep a dumbbell close by. All right. So we have 20 seconds of each exercise we're gonna do here, okay? So take it down to the mat. And the first thing I want you to do is side dips on a holding a side plank. And we're gonna do 20 seconds dips up and down and then we're going to switch sides okay so i want you to stay right on your elbow um, you also can modify 
and be up on your hand here, okay, if you prefer. 20 seconds, make sure your chest is open, your hips are stacked. Ready? 20 and go. Push that hip up, okay, you wanna contract the oblique. Make sure you're stacked straight like a wall, okay? You don't wanna hunch over like this. Drive the hip up. The action comes up right here. Five seconds left. Two, and time. Okay, let's switch other side. 20 seconds. Three, two, one, stack it, and go. Control, okay? This is not about how fast you go. This is about tapping up and drive. You want to use the oblique, stay focused. What muscle group are you using, right? <sighs> Halfway. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Whoo! Nice work. Grab a dumbbell. We're going to move into folding in and out crunches. Okay? 20 seconds. Open the abs up, and then you're going to fold in and bring the dumbbell towards your toes, okay? Open and extend, and bring the dumbbell towards your toes. Three, two, 20 seconds, go! If you don't want to use a dumbbell, just use your body weight only. Totally fine to modify. And obviously, the heavier the dumbbell, the harder it is, right? So you want to kick back, keep your back flat on the ground as you extend out. Pelvis tilt right there. Eight seconds, five, four, three, two, one more, one. Good work. All right, so our next one, you're using your dumbbell again. You're gonna bring your knees up to an L shape, okay? You're gonna rest your dumbbell up on your knees, okay? You can even put it out further if you want. And you're gonna crunch up, hands are off to the side, 20 seconds. Shoulder blades don't touch the ground. Go. Push your low back into the mat. Woo, come on, 10 seconds, go for 10, nine. Five seconds left, four, three, squeeze hard, two, and there's time, 20. Nice job. Okay, and our last core exercise, you're gonna put your hands off to the side, knees are up, and you're gonna do single leg taps down and up, okay? This is to perfect that transverse. I want you to have proper form on this. So let's pelvis tilt here, pelvis tilt in, push that back flat, hands are off to the side, knees are in an L shape, and drop and up. Take your time on these, keep your back flat the entire time, 20 seconds, 15 left, Keep your abs pulled in nice and hard the whole time. Come on, you're almost there. Eight seconds. Really perfect that form here. Challenge your back to stay pelvis tilted and flat the whole time. Four, three, two, and one. Excellent, good. That's also a great one for those mamas who are recovering from um, pregnancy. If you guys are postpartum, that's a great exercise to start with. I've had three boys myself, so I know a thing or two about coming back from uh, pregnancy. So start with those ones, those are great. Okay, we're gonna go back to the beginning. Side plank first, 20 seconds, each exercise. Okay, we ready? Stack the feet, elbows right underneath. Okay, you wanna be like a wall. Open the chest up, 20 seconds and go. Come on, think about that oblique that's closest to the ground. Squeeze it up. Work hard, work hard. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, time. Awesome, other side. Doing great. Okay, load that elbow right underneath the shoulder. Okay, you don't want it to be out here and you don't want it to be too close into you either. Protect your joints. Stack it, 20, and go. Take your time. 
not about speed. Ah, five seconds. Come on, drive it up there. Four, three, two, ah, one. Yes, awesome. On your back, grab that dumbbell. You're gonna do folding in and out crunches. 20 seconds, hit it. All right. Oh, that back, keep it flat. Come on, get your abs working. Great job. Halfway, 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Let's go, let's go. Two, get one more in. Done. Moving on to the third exercise, okay? You're in that L shape, okay? Keep your feet together. Put the dumbbell out closer to your shins. Rest it, lift the shoulders up, and go. 20 seconds hard, right here. Keep it quick. Don't let the abs break. Halfway, nine, eight. Come on, squeeze hard for five, four, three, two, time, one. Nice job. On those ones as well, you can absolutely put a, a medicine ball out there or no weight either if you want to just do body weight. Okay, let's rest our heads, rest your whole upper body. Bring your legs back up to that L shape. Okay, 20 seconds, heel tap to the floor and let's go. Pull your transverse in. Push your belly button down towards your spine. Let's perfect that pelvis tilt. Train your core. We want to be deliberate and strong. Good. Halfway there, 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Awesome. Good work. All right, guys, this is our last round, okay? So give it all you got. Let's keep that dumbbell. Let's work hard. Perfect that form, okay? We ready? Side plank, 20 seconds, and go. Everything you got, come on, everything you got. You know what to do. Three seconds, two, and time. Other side. 20 seconds, stack it up, and let's go. Ten. Come on. You got it. Five seconds. Four, three, two, get it up there. One more. Ah, good job. Second exercise. Weighted, folding in and out. All right, we ready? Three, two, one, work. Keep that back flat. Come on, 10 seconds left. Halfway. Five, four, three, get it. Two, last one. Awesome. Woo. All right, two left. Everything you got, burn the core out, okay? Rest the dumbbell out on the shins. Feet are together, 20 seconds, and go. Keep it continuous. Come on, push. Right here. Burn them out. Breathe, breathe. Halfway. Five seconds. Three, two, and done. Nice work. Okay, our very last one. Hands off to the side. Back up in that L shape. 20 second taps. Go. Down and up. Keep that transverse. Push down. Belly button towards the spine. Perfect that form. Come on. 12 seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Get it. 
three, come on, two, one more tap, one more tap, down, up, and done. Complete. Way to go. Whew. That was awesome. Great job, you guys. 30 minute core and arms workout with Amy Jo. I hope you guys had a great workout. You can also follow me on Instagram at Amy Jo Fitness. I would love to do this again with you guys. So thumbs up, leave great comments. Um, give me some feedback too if you wanna see some other things that we can um, help you guys stay fit at home. Um, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you guys. Have a great day.